In this tutorial, we will create a trade station strategy based on daily breakouts. Generally, breakout systems are proven to be robust and profitable. Create a new trade station strategy and call it daily breakout. Add condition, price, we will use the current close price. Cross is above, resistance. The time interval will be 12 hours, at fixed time of the day, and the time interval ends at 10 o'clock. Here is a short explanation of support, resistance, and time interval. We want to draw the resistance on the chart. We won't set the stop loss because we're going to use trailing stop instead. But we will set the take profit 200 points. You can find the definition of one point in symbol properties. For example, for E mini Russell, one point is equal to 1 one hundredth. Now, create the opposite to sell. The price crosses below support and the take profit is 200 points. It's correct. A word of advice, if the website becomes a bit slow due to the number of conditions, just hit Ctrl R to refresh. It helps. Instead of closing the trade, we will use the take profit and trailing stop. In the common tab, add trailing stop. For long positions, the trailing stop will be at support, the last 12 bars, and we don't want to draw it on the chart because it would draw too many lines as the stop loss has moved. Create the opposite trailing stop for short positions. Because we still haven't limited the number of trades, the order will be sent multiple times when the price moves around the support or resistance. We want to send the next order on the next day. So we check next open trade after time of the day, 10 o'clock, which is the ending time of the support or resistance interval. In money management, we will use a fixed size of one contract and we can set it as input. The source is ready. That's pretty fast work. Copy, create new strategy, paste, verify. Let's back test it. We see that support and resistance are shown as blue lines. When the bar closes above the resistance or below the support, the order is executed on the next bar. The stop loss and take profit are virtual. As the trade moves our way, the virtual stop loss is trailed. For now, we are not interested in the performance because we will optimize the take profit and other parameters in the next videos in this tutorial.